Uh, look, obviously, um, it's a tough way to lose a game. Tip your hat to Atlanta. I thought um, they played better than us today. Um, I told our players, you know, you can focus more on the result of that game. And as a coach, our jobs are to focus more on what caused the result. And I, I, we're not doing, we didn't do enough things well today. Um, that always bothers you as the coach because you're, you're wanting to see your performance be more consistent, better. But uh, too many penalties, too many long yardage situations. We put ourselves behind the, behind the eight ball a number of times on offense in the first half. You know, we finally put together a few drives at the end of the game. Um, you know, we, we didn't do the things that winning teams do consistently. Uh, in our league, and we've got to get that cor corrected. We've got to do a better job coaching. It starts with me uh, being more consistent. Some areas, our third down numbers now, two, three weeks in a row have been just average at best, and, uh, and we kind of go from there. But, it, you know, it is what it is. Questions? Go ahead. Go ahead. Quicker transition, like? Well, we, we sped up the tempo in the fourth quarter. Not in the, I mean, yeah, so there was a point at which we were down more than two scores. Quickly, we got into a two-minute mode. Um, fortunately, we were able to score. And we kind of stayed with that the next drive. And then once the time was in our favor then we, we kind of went back to a little bit more traditional approach on the on the final drive where we scored so yeah that happened uh, I'm going to say probably no third to last drive fourth to last drive in the game well you're looking at the scoreboard and saying you, you can't just meander along here you know and, and run handoffs and huddle up I mean we, we needed uh, we needed to get get moving a little bit Yeah, look, yeah, yeah. Um, you know, typically you take a knee there. They took a knee on the next play, so yeah. And we, we got it punched out. I don't know who did, you know, and um, it's hard to see. But yeah, the, you're, when it's that close, you know, you've seen us in that position before, run the clock down, kick the field goal with no, with no time left. So um, yeah, and he was smart enough where he was going to not score. <coughs> I thought overall, well, you know, we missed some, some pickups. Um, I thought he came to some, man, he had a few throws in there that were, I mean, not primary receivers and played with poise, brought us back. I thought overall, uh, I felt like it was good. Um, and then, of course, we'll look at it and, and grade it. But I thought we dropped a few balls uh, more than our fair share. And like I said, you know, we're third and long. I don't know how many times with the, the penalties in the first half, but it's frustrating. Correct. Yeah. <laughs> yes. You want to stay on top of your coverage in that situation. You know, we're playing a three deep zone. So. Coach, how much are you use Taysom. Um, yeah, each – look, we, we got a package. I thought he gave us some energy when he came in. There was some – you know, we had a run. We had, we had a handful of plays. It was just kind of how the game went. And, and look, if you're not converting third downs, then your, your number count is not going to be 70-some offensive player. 80, you're just going to have a shorter amount of plays. So he's, he's part of the plan. Yeah. I think it was in the second half. There was a sequence of plays. Look, we were getting a lot of single safety, man-to-man -man looks, and we got to one of his runs earlier, and then we got to some play-action passes. Um, a lot of it was by design. Was there a thought of 
It wasn't changing the quarterback to, uh, yeah, and, I, and that's a fair question. But no, it was more of trying to get to a play that we had that he was taking the snaps of. Yeah, look, he's a good football player, and it's, um, it's always difficult when you lose a starter like that. Um, so we had to make some adjustments, and hopefully he can get back on the field quicker than uh, later. But yeah, that's tough. No update. We'll get, keep you guys posted. No. Well, the time you would say you're out of your game plan a little bit is when we we were in that hurry up offense, um, the third, or fourth to lap. You know, the the minute we got into no huddle, you're kind of out of your game plan there. You know, you're you're having to react according to the score of the game and the time left on the clock. That would be. And then kind of the next series, we were still in hurry up, scored. That final series, we were back in our game plan. Like, you know, the time was in our favor then. Say it again. Uh, it's hard to tell. We'll, we got to see the film. It was a running play, but, you know, um, it, it happened so quick. We'll watch and make corrections on it, see what happened. Yeah, I think that's fair to say. I mean, I don't know what his numbers were, but they were pretty good. Yeah, I think it's fair to say that. Yeah, well, well it wasn't just receivers. I saw other guys dropping balls. All right, thank you.